Hey folks, Will Owen here with JetBoatPilot.com. On today's video, we're going to show you a little hack that we just learned, how to take rust stains out of sea deck or a marine mat. Bring the camera in tight here, I want to show you something. This is a uh, rust stain that we found on one of our pads. We had a uh, old uh, steel shot ballast bag that had uh, leaked some rust out on one of our, our pads and we thought it was ruined. So before we threw it away, we wanted to test uh, some products and see if we could get the rust out. This is a toilet bowl cleaner that you get from Home Depot. And normally I wouldn't try this on Sea Deck or Marine Mat because it's got some uh, hydrogen chloride in it. But because it's such a small amount, I thought, well, I'm gonna throw it away anyway. Let's give it a shot. So we sprayed some on. You can see, just take it and spray it on, pour it on, rub it in. You probably wanna use rubber gloves when you do this. I'm a little hard headed, but I would recommend rubber gloves if you're gonna do this. Rub it in. Once you've got it rubbed in, Probably going to want to let it sit a few minutes. Yeah, I can feel it stinging my fingers already. Probably best to do this with rubber glove. This set up over the weekend and I was just, I forgot it. Didn't realize I had that bag on top of it. So once we've got that on there, I'm going to give it just a little bit of water. And then we're going to take our stiff bristle brush. This is a $4 brush from Home Depot. Make sure it's a stiff bristle brush. I would also recommend brushing with the grain versus against the grain. It's just going to help preserve the look. Rinse it off. Now you can see it's about 90% gone. I'm gonna go over it with one more pass and it should finish the job. Probably gonna leave it on a little bit longer this time, let it soak in and we'll try again. Use the brush this time so it doesn't sting my fingers. I would also advise don't let this stuff get on your upholstery. We've uh, used it extensively down on the lower swim platform. It hasn't hurt anything. But uh, I have not tried it on upholstery yet, so I'd recommend that you be careful to keep it off your upholstery. If you do get some on, rinse it off quickly. All right, we're going to let this sit, and then we will uh, scrub it again. All right, so now we've let it sit for about five minutes. We're going to give it a little bit more water, and then we'll scrub with our stiff bristle brush here. Again, going with the grain. camera in. We've just got really faint discoloration right here, here, and here. So a couple more passes, this should be good as new. But you can see from the original to now, it's actually still a useful pad that you don't have to throw away. So if you get in a jam and there are conventional cleaners such as Deck Magic or other cleaners don't work, it's okay to use this toilet bowl cleaner. We're using the works. There's other bowl, there's other brands out there. Uh, Use it sparingly, wear your rubber gloves, be cautious, keep it off your upholstery, but it's gonna really make the pad where you can keep it versus throwing it away. So we hope this video was helpful to you. For more questions about how to clean your C-Deck, 
visit us at jetboatpilot.com or obviously through social media, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. We thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. Have a great day.